everybody. I am here with a trying Japanese snacks too because I just received my Christmas package from my friend. So, haven't opened it yet, got it earlier, and uh, I'm gonna see what's in here. I really like um, the texture of this tape. It's it's making a nice ripping sound. I don't I don't know what I'm saying. Okay. I don't, I don't know if I like this tape. My favorite snack to get is uh, this pizza potato, and um, I ha I've never seen this uh, packaging before. Quattro for cheese flavor, honey cheese flavor flakes. Ooh, ooh! Somebody thinks she's getting snack. I have nothing. I have nothing for baby. All right, so I'm just going to take everything out first and then I guess try some things. Here is Olsatsu Snack. This looks like, yeah, it's um like a sweet potato flavor. Sounds good. Haven't tried this before, but it sounds yummy. <coughs> We got the classic potato chips. Uh, happy butter flavor. Uh, we have the OG pizza potato. We have, what is this? Tabeko dobutsu. Tabeko dobutsu. Like animal crackers? Biscuit? Hell yes. M duck. What does it say M duck on the back? Can you even see this? Got got a horse got this is backwards, so I can't read it. Pelican? M duck. Mr. Duck? Lion dog. Deer. Cow. Sheep. Oh, and Carmilla. <laughs> Um, oh my gosh, they're, oh, they're so, okay. They're big. So it looks like we got two different packaging here. I don't know what the difference is. Oh, one is uh, the little bamboo, which is this one. And then one is a little tree or mushroom, I guess because it's kinoko, right? Right? Yeah. Yep. All right. Like I said, I've, I've already had these, but these are good. And it's individual packaging, so I will have them. Oh, I'll show you what they look like. Strawberry chocolate and Regular chocolate. Okay. Okay. Yup. It's pretty good. All right. Strawberry is like really like tangy.
I guess if you've had like the strawberry pocky, then you've tasted like that Japanese strawberry flavor. Um, but I feel like our strawberry candies and stuff don't really have that tang. It's really good. Very sweet. I like it. I'm going to put it up here. Carmilla is in her house, which is right behind my phone. So hopefully she doesn't get to it. All right. Ooh, butter flavor. Ooh, no eggs. Ooh, Monday Selection 2019. Oh, sorry, Monde Gold Award. This is amazing. Fight! Why does it say fight on the back? No fighting. Are you are you supposed to make them fight? Uh, how do I? Look? Bigger pack. Yeah. No. Ox. Leopard. Bat. Ahiru. Saru. Lion. Wani. Kuma. Buta. I know animals. There we go. <sighs> Smell like something, but can't. Can't really place the, the flavor. We got a deer. These poor animals have been branded. All right. So. I expected these to have like a harder texture. They have more of a texture of like a goldfish cracker or like a cheese it um, Not sweet like I thought. I kind of thought they'd be like a sweet kind of biscuit. Um, very good though. It's like, it's sweet. It definitely tastes like, like a butter biscuit, but it's like Kind of a more refined sweetness, I guess. Eep. <laughs> this one's an eagle, but <laughs> eagle's printed on this way. So I'm like, what do you mean that's an eagle? Is, it, is that not a fish? It is an eagle. Oh my God, you cannot have them. Okay. I give. Well, I give Kino Konoyama. Mm, Three point five stars. <laughs> I give. I only tried two. I give Tabeko Dobutsu. I give that. Mm, um, squirrel. I give it four stars. I wasn't sure if I want to give it four or four and a half, but I'm making it four. Can you hear her digging? Oh my god. these taste like which I don't know how many people are gonna know what what this flavor is because I only ever had it uh, in Japan so these taste a lot like I had these butter rusks in Japan which is basically if you don't know what that is it's like this is gonna sound kind of unappetizing I guess but like toast but like 
Hmm. How do I describe it? It's like really hard, like toast. Um, <laughs> and it was butter flavor. <laughs> I mean, these are butter flavors, so I guess it, you know, it checks out. But that's what these taste like. And I loved the rusk, so these are uh, horse. These are good. I like them. I will finish them. All right. Well, I'm going to finish this section before Carmilla has a chance to knock over my phone. So, that's part one of the video. I am going to try the pizza potato. Four cheese, four quattro four cheese. All right, there we go. Oh, I didn't even read. Blue cheese, cheddar, emmen, emmental, and com camembert cheese or whatever. Smell like pizza potato chips. Okay. I'm so excited and so anxious. I'm gonna show you guys a chip. Whoa. So got the little flakes on it. No surprise. These are amazing. I love them. Um, five stars. So, very similar to pizza potato already. Potato. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right. So it tastes pretty fam like pretty similar to piece of potato. <laughs> um, it's a little bit different. Like you can tell it has like more than just the two types of cheese because I think on the original it was just two types of cheese. Um, no. Oh, and there's honey, too. Wow. So, <clears throat> yeah, I'm not really sure how they do this. Um, but, like, the little flakes on here, let me find a piece that has a lot of flakes. Like this one, they're, like, kind of creamy. Um, it's interesting. I like it. I think it's really good. Oh, they're saying this is a more adult-oriented pizza potato. Not for kids. Adults only. what this smells like but it smells very familiar you can see them there very tiny a lot smaller than I thought they'd be they're so cute I'm very good very very good Yeah.
they just taste like sweet potato, which I guess isn't surprising. Um, texture is like, mm, what is the texture like? I don't know what American snack to compare the texture to, but they're really light. Um, I guess kind of similar to like a cheese curl kind of texture. They're flat. I'll give this one four stars. I have bangs now. So we're reviewing the last of the snacks. We have the Shia La Cebata flavored potato chips. Happy butter flavored potato chips. You want some? first. Oh my god, that smells so good. Let me show you. But, so that's what they look like. Alright, I'm gonna try it. Mm. Oh yeah. Oh my God, wow. Honestly, honestly, five stars. So they're very similar to the original like salt flavored potato chips um, of this specific brand, I mean. But the butter flavor is just like so strong in a good way. Um, it says there's mascarpone cheese in it. Um, let's see. I guess, yeah. Can kind of taste it. It mostly just tastes like um, like butter, <laughs> like butter. Um, it's sweet. It's very sweet, and it is a little salty. I thought I would mention because I didn't realize this when I was going through these that these little bamboo shoot ones. Um, they're a little bit different than, than the little mushroom ones. Um, only in that, I don't think they taste as much as, of, as much of strawberry than the trees, or mushrooms sorry um but mostly the biscuit is like crumbly like it's more cookie like like a hard cookie than the the mushroom ones they're more like a pocky like hard kind of biscuit i guess texture. Um, they're still good. I actually like the mushrooms better, but these are still pretty good. Well, that's my video. I'm excited to see how uh, messy this is going to turn out. Thanks for watching. Hope I can do another one of these sometime soon. Um, if you have any video suggestions, you can leave them in the comments. I'm also active on Twitter and Tumblr.
So I'll leave those links in the description. Um, as I say in every single video, hope to make more videos soon. Um, I actually have a well thought out one written and I just need to kind of go over it and then film it and edit. Um, so look forward to that. But yes, thank you for watching. Uh, take it easy. What's your favorite Japanese snack? Tell me in the comments. If you'd say Pocky. If you say Pocky. You're getting blockied. <laughs> bye bye.